How's it going, everybody? Now, you know, people have <clears throat> asked me, <clears throat> excuse me, asked me what's my favorite, um, you know, comedy movies of all time. Um, and I'm about to tell y'all what's my absolute favorite comedy movies of all time. Um, so yeah, let's get started with this. So, I'm going to start off with Little Man. These two both are my, one of my favorites too, Little Man. Now, Little Man's freaking hilarious, you know. It's a great story. Um, it's about this midget, you know, um, that acts like he's a baby to try to steal the diamond. So, um, so, like, so him and his partner can steal the diamond and stuff. It's pretty crazy. And you also got this movie, White Chicks. This movie's similar to Big Mama's House. It's just like Big Mama's House. Almost the same, actually. And this film is freaking hilarious. I love this movie. It's really good. Um, it's the same people who brought you Little Man. And White Chicks is really good. Um, I enjoy it. Really good. It's similar to Big Mama's House. Now, next we have Word of Millers. These are all my favorite comedies, though. I got a bunch of comedy movies, but these, I'm just putting out what's my favorites. Now, Word of the Millers. This movie is so much rated R, and it's freaking hilarious. And um, Jennifer Aniston, she's a good actor, and um, and I remember when this kid right here gets bit um, by a spider in the balls. It's freaking hilarious, and um, it's crazy. It's it's a funny movie. Um, if you have not seen it before, I highly recommend it. If you love you know, stupid funny movies. It's kind of like stupid funny. All right, next we have Horrible Bosses 1 and 2. Now, these are hard rated R2. Like, these films are freaking hilarious. You know, 1 and 2, both of them funny. I enjoy them every second of them. It's, it's just freaking hilarious. Um, Like I said, if you haven't seen none of these, y'all should check these out. Horrible Bosses 1 and 2. Good films. Now next we have Big Mama's House 1, 2, and 3. Now, this is a little controversial. You know, I've seen some people that don't like Big Mama's House. And I'm like, why won't you like this? Because these films are so entertaining and funny. Um, They're so entertaining and funny. Big Mama's House 1, 2, and Big Mama's House Like Father Like Son is just really, really fun. I remember when I was getting ready to go see... Big Mama Sells Like Father Like Son a few years ago, and then I didn't have no money to go um, to the theater to go see it, so it was like far away somewhere else, though. It was playing somewhere else, so I couldn't go see it. So, it's, um, so when I bought it on DVD and I lost it, and then I ended up buying this three pack that came with all of them, but when I saw it, I loved it. It's an enjoyable movie, it's funny as hell, good film. Now, um, and plus, Bill, I was also PG-13, it's crazy. Um, now, the reason I'm saying that, because I'm saying everybody know, like, if y'all try to check these out, if, um, they're too bad for, you know, you, your kids to watch and all this stuff, or y'all might not, if it's, like, red dark, y'all might not want to see it, so. Now, now we got the, um, uh, American Pie Collection. I love all of these films, all of them. Like, dude, these films make me laugh my ass off. So, this is, like, eight film collection. I got this from the pawn shop for only, like, a dollar for all eight of them. I was like, what? So, I bought it, and then I started watching all of them, and they're freaking hilarious. They're entertaining and hilarious. Underrated R, and they're unrated, but um, it's really funny movies. All of them are really freaking funny and stuff. So, yeah, great films. Now, next we have B Medea's Witness Protection. This Witness Protection. Now, this film, I remember when I saw this in theaters, that's the time I, we had a lot of money at the time. And I went to the one, you know, Christiansburg Theater, and I saw this movie, and I thought it was freaking funny. I thought it was hilarious. And also, this movie is PG-13, by the way, and it's hilarious, and it's freaking funny as hell. Now, next we have... You know, Next we have Medea's Yeah, Medea's Family Reunion. Now this film is also PG thirteen. Now this film is 
um, fantastic. It's funny and entertaining, and Joe's hilarious. You know that old man Joe, and Dia's hilarious also. It's just a funny film. Um, really good, really good. If you haven't seen this, please check it out. Next we have Madea on uh, Madea Christmas. I'm gonna have this review up, give y'all my like full thoughts on it. Um, near you know I have to live a few days after Thanksgiving because this could be part of my Christmas review. So yeah, I'm gonna do this review full review. But I enjoy this movie. It's funny. It's so good. And this is also PG-13, but it's so good. And it's one of the best Christmas movies. Um, next we have Boo on Madea Halloween, and this is also PG technique. Now this film <clears throat> is so freaking funny. I laugh from beginning to end. This film is just so hilarious. I enjoy every second of this film. Um, it's just so well done, so well done. Okay, next we have Boo. Two of Madea Halloween. Now this film is the same thing. It's so funny, you know. But the like they go to this Halloween party, like Derek and a bunch of stuff goes down. And then you find out who pranks him at the end, towards the end of the movie. So really fun movie, funny. And this is also PG-13, funny. All the Madea ones are PG-13, by the way. But funny as hell. Now Madea goes to jail. This film. It's one of my all-time favorite Madea movies. This and this is no surprise there because a lot of people love this movie. Um, and this is also PG-13. Like I said, all the Madea ones are PG-13. And this film is freaking hilarious. How she goes to jail and stuff. It's, it's crazy. Um, really fun movie. I enjoy it. Now we got these movies that's too bad for a lot of people to watch, and that is Ted and Ted. Two. I remember when I saw Ted 2 in theaters a few years back, and plus, this is like rated R, of course, like, it's hard every R, rated R, it's really bad for anybody to watch, it's, it, I, I enjoy it, but it's really bad for a lot of people to watch, that's why I don't think they made a third one yet, but I wanted to make a third one, because it, I enjoy these movies, these movies are funny as hell, but the steady bear that smokes weed and stuff, and then, um, you know, Mark Wahlberg, um, he wished this day to come alive as a kid. It's, it's pretty funny movie. And then now next we have Happy Gilmore and Billy Madison and Chuck and Larry. But I remember when I let somebody borrow this, nobody brought it back. See, nobody brought it back. So I quit trusting that much people. But, um, yeah, um, Happy Gilmore fantastic film it's like a sports film golf about golf um and stuff and then you got billy madison when you know Adamson goes back to school to try to get smarter it's a pretty new movie and then chuck and larry's funny as hell i like chuck and larry now next we got click big daddy 50 first dates and mr deeds now there's like three of them i enjoy that is click big daddy and 50 first dates mm. Oh, and by the way, these are all PG-13s right here. And then, not all of his movies are, but I'm just showing, I'm just telling you straight up, like, a lot of these are PG-13. And, Click, I enjoy, it's funny, it's entertaining as hell, it's so good, I enjoy it. Um, so, yeah. Now we got Anger Management, and Don't Mess With The Zohan. These films are freaking hilarious, so good. Now we got... That's my boy. I saw this at theater. This is rated R. Let me see if these rated R. Um, these are PG-13, by the way. And these, this is rated R. Hard every R. Rated R. Um, this is freaking funny as hell. I enjoy this film a lot. Now we got um, Grown Ups and Grown Ups 2. Now, these are PG-13. Um, now, it's, it's funny because this is hilarious, you know. The first one's the best, in my opinion. The second one's... Um, I enjoy it, but it ain't as good as the first one. Now, I do enjoy it, and these are still my favorite comedies. One of my favorite comedies, and they're freaking hilarious. Um, I enjoy them. 
The first one, you know, he plays basketball at the end. It's pretty cool. Now, next we have Ride Along. These are PG-13. Ride Along 1 and 2. Now, I enjoy these movies. These movies are my, one of my favorite comedies. All these movies are showing y'all is my favorite comedy movies. Ride Along 1 and 2, amazing films. Now, next we have Joe Dirt. Now, this film, I'm, this is PG-13, but this film I enjoy a lot. Now, um, this film is so good, so funny. I highly recommend it if you have not seen it. Now, we're back to my bottom four, and that came with four of these movies. Of course, Ice Cube, I'm a huge fan of his movies too. Like, I showed you a few of them, like, you know, Ride Along 1 and 2. But Friday, next Friday, and Friday at the next, amazing films. I love them. I love these movies. And then I got all about the Benjamins, fantastic films. All four of these are awesome. They're rewatchable. I'll rewatch these anytime. So, yeah, um, I guess that's it. For, and by the way, that movie, Click, if you have not seen it, I highly recommend that movie. That movie is freaking good. It's not just like an ordinary comedy. It's entertaining. It's good like imagine you getting your remote and it does random stuff it, it's crazy if you have not seen click watch it that's one of my favorite comedies i got a lot of favorite comedies that's why i showed you a lot of my favorite comedies so yeah um yeah so those are basically my favorite comedies um those are ones i co will constantly rewatch. so yeah um if y'all enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and please subscribe and share. I guess I'm out here and hit the bell so you know when the video is uploaded. I guess I'm out here and peace out. That's it for this video. Peace.